Hey crafty friends, it's Mel. I just wanted to share a small little paper haul of some new papers that they got, American Crafts and such, um, from Joann's. So, <laughs> Joann's is not really my favorite store, especially we have two by us. One's over by the mall, and the one over by the mall, believe it or not, got rid of their scrapbook section altogether. Like, there's no scrapbook area whatsoever. Then there's one close to my house that um, is in kind of like a dying shopping center and I don't have faith it'll be there forever if you know what I mean but surprisingly that one got some new papers in and it was papers that you didn't see over and over and over again and in fact although Hobby Lobby changes theirs a lot too at work I kind of felt like I was looking at the same paper because I'm cleaning them up all the time but um because that particular area gets really messy um especially when kids go over there yeah um, so anyway, sorry, that was Miss Talia. So anyway, we finally got new paper too over at Hobby Lobby. So, um, all the stores should slowly be getting theirs in. It may not be in yet at all stores near you. Um, but it'll be a little refreshing to see some different patterns and such. So that's kind of how I felt, um, for these ones in particular. And right now, I think it may have changed. I went yesterday, which was Sunday and it was, um, 10, was it 10 or 20? 20 papers for two dollars no maybe it was whatever equals to 20 cents each i think is what they came to so um it's too early so um these are some american crafts papers and i got a few of uh certain ones because i'd love to make a fall a new fall mini album um and fall is my favorite so there's some like um they're not necessarily fall they're just a lot of different things you can use and i love these so these are just the regular they're not thick um but these are by American Crafts, and this is called, let's see, does it say? No, it doesn't. The collection. If it does, I don't see it. It just says the color of memories, but I think that's American Crafts brand. But this looks familiar. I think it was um, Jen Hatfield, maybe? Okay. Um, now that was Maya. Um, so, anyway, um, I think this is from Jen Hatfield line, because um, I have a smaller 6x6. Six um, but I love a lot of these patterns because you can chop these up. So that's why I got a couple. I think I got two of these and then I got a few of this plaid one. I'll show you. But these say things um, that range from uh, thank you. Hello, friend. Happy day. Hello there. Thank you so much. You're my greatest adventure. So you can clip congrats. You can clip these out and just use them as embellishments. And you have so many just on one, you know, cheap sheet of paper. So I got two of those. Then these ones are similar. Um, these are more like the it doesn't have to be winter it can be fall i love this um buffalo check um that's been getting a little bit more popular but um this one says happy day just for you thank you thinking of you you are my home eat drink and be cozy i love those um made with love oh happy day enjoy the little things hooray i love this um black background and like little wood stumps shape of a heart thinking of you happy birthday thanks so all these little things can be used you know, just as your embellishment on a card or, you know, cut up. So I got two of those. Actually, I lied. I got three of those. Um, must have been liking that one. And then this one, I think I got five of. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six of because I want to use this. I love this. And with a lot of these patterns, like even these ones back here. So, like, these look really nice. Um, these cozy um, fall things. These look really nice with it. And you'll see some others, too. So um, I got a bunch of those, so that was my plan for those. That's why I got them, because you hate to run out and then not have that paper available. This one is by Paper Pizzazz, so it's not even the same, you know, American Crafts line. Most of I, what I got was American Crafts. Then this one here says, um, take me to the mountains, a little deer head in a wood pattern. Um, hold on to what keeps you warm. That's cute. Just breathe. Let your light shine. You are my home. This is my favorite. Cozy. The feeling of comfort when being warm and snuggled. Let's stay home. I like that too. Um, cabin rules. Read books, play games, make memories, take walks, watch sunsets, seek wildlife. Home is whenever, home is wherever I'm with you. Warm and cozy and home is where the heart is. So just some warm, cozy little sayings. So I got three of those to cut those up and keep them as embellishments or maybe share some. Um, this one wouldn't be one I'd normally pick. I got two sheets of this. It's by American Crafts too. Yeah, see, there's no title on these, but um, nothing on the back, right? Yeah, but these are, they say, um, they're like, uh, what are these, three by four? 
um, little cards that you can cut up and they're made to look like seed packets. So see how they say like 55 cents or 25 cents, you know, forget me not 55 cents. So they say kindness is contagious, seeds for your garden, warm wishes. Like this could be a card front. You could even make the small little cards. I um, do a lot of de-stashing on here um, and I got out of it for a little bit only because I didn't have them prepped but I like to send just something small or like a small little card that says you know thank you or whatever just a quick hello but I thought these would be really cute for that so it says thank you this one says hello thank you very much hello there like these would be perfect the hello hello just because um, thinking of you thank you grateful for all you do hello there seeds for your garden so all just cute stuff like that so I got two of those because I wanted to make I'm just gonna um, get the size figured out which I think is three by four and just make it into a card you can make a bunch out of a 12 by 12 sheet get the card bases ready and just attach this maybe with a little bit of a um, border and you have a really cute card with little to no effort um, so sometimes those are good and you can make them up ahead of time and then have them ready and that's where that would be good for me for when I'm packing up my de-stash items and then I just want to send out a little card with them. So this one was cute. Um, this is by American Crafts 2 and it says a bunch of different little things. These are the small little squares. Um, say ho ho ho, holly jolly, um, tidings of comfort and joy, very merry Christmas to you, warm wishes, a little gingerbread man, deck the halls, merry Christmas with the tree on the truck, on the car. We wish you a Merry Christmas, Merry and Bright, Mistletoe. So all types of cute little holiday cheer, joy for Santa cookies. All types of cute little things there. Um, and then this one is, I think, the matching, the, I hope I'm saying this right, three by four cards. That's what I'm guessing. Um, so it's like the Project Life card. So it says, making spirits bright, let it snow, Merry Christmas, joy, Noel, season's greeting, tis the season, ho, 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 give joy, happy holidays, and holiday cheer. I really like that one. The holiday chair with the little elves little elves and sh and he's eating whatever icing's in there and it's got all over his face and i think it's funny and she's blushing um and there's a little elf decorating a tree so really cute so again these are thinner papers these aren't like the thick cards but you could either back them or just you know put them behind a album sleeve i got this one i'm sure i have something similar it just drew me to it because you guys know i love the fall <laughs> Uh, most of you are crazy about Christmas, but fall is my thing. Um, I like Christmas too, but you guys know, those of you who follow me for a while, and those of you who are new, welcome to my channel. You will get to see, I've, did, I've done a few home tours and fall hauls and different things like that. Um, so um, that is my favorite. My daughter asked me the other day, what's your favorite holiday? Daddy was just like, fall, <laughs> like it's not really a holiday, it's just, just that time of year. I'm a September baby, born September 9th. So I don't know if that's why, or I just love it. Even though my mom's a hater, my mom says, um, she's like, I love you, but I just, she's like, Sept she's like, fall time, it's not really my favorite because everything just looks dead outside. She's like, everything's kind of like fried and you know, kind of all the flowers are kind of killed by the sun and she's really being a Debbie Downer. <laughs> but um, you know, she has a point there. However, I choose to see it. I see all the trees um, turning colors, the leaves turning colors, and see the beauty in that. But, um, you know, everybody's different. Everybody has a different holiday, and fall just happens to be mine. So, um, moving on to Halloween. I don't think they had a... I thought they had maybe a smaller one of these. I'll have to check back. I bet you they did, because it seems to be a pattern. As you see, they have the 3 by 4 cards and then the little small squares, because I would have liked to have them. Um, but maybe they didn't. But I picked up this one by American Crafts as well. And there's a big 31 trick or treat. Um, spooky, spooky, creepy, creepy. Halloween is very eeky. Um, there is magic in the night when pumpkins glow by candlelight. That'd be really cute to put on a page of my daughters carving their pumpkins as they do each year. Um, this one says, too cute to spook. Got candy, spooky, spooky Halloween. Pumpkin time, I like that one. This one says, boo, from me to you. You can put that on a card. A witch and her little monsters live here. You know, I saw a sign somewhere out in my my gallivanting and my adventures um, at a store, and it said something similar to this, like a witch and her little monsters live here, along with a handsome devil. <laughs> so I thought that was cute. I should have got that for Ricky. He would have got a kick out of it. Um, then this one says, eat, drink, and be scary. And this one says, baddie for you. There's that. And then last but not least, this one may seem very basic. I just thought it was pretty like little out of focus candles um, and how easy to put a birthday photo, which Talia just turned three and we had her little party and then a little title up here. So um, that was just a cheap little haul. It was um, 
I think it was 10, yeah, it was 10 for $2 and I got 20. So, um, I picked a, and it, it, you don't even have to get the full amount. It's, um, 20 cents no matter what you pick. So, um, 20 cents each. So you could just get a couple if you wanted to, but I don't know if that sale maybe ended Sunday or maybe it started. I don't know how their sales work. See our shop right there Saturday to Saturday. So I don't know if, um, Joann's is a little different, but I just want to share them with you because either way, these are there. They're regularly 79 cents each. So um, I picked up a few when they're on sale, but I haven't gotten paper, loose leaf paper, um, because we don't have like a, what do you guys call it? A LSS, like local scrapbook store, <laughs> like a, um, what are they called? Like a mom and pop one that has the nice new papers. So say like Lawn Fawn or um, the different collections and stuff. Like we just had a Joann's and a Michael's and an AC Moore um, and now a Hobby Lobby that just have like, I don't know how to explain it, but you're not going to, you're not going to get all the kits and the different, the different things there, the newer stuff. So, um, this was kind of nice to see in my Joann's as normally it's like a, like a, <laughs> you know, not so hot place to shop, but I just went in cause I wanted to look at the fall. I didn't buy anything other than my paper. So I was good, but, um, but yeah, it's still fun for me to go out and look. So um, let me know if any of you have hit your Joann's and found out of these papers. Just want to share with you, this with you guys so that way if there are any papers that you saw that you liked that you can get them while they're still there or possibly on sale. Don't know if they are this week or not. You'll have to call and see when their sales run, like what, what day to what day. Hopefully it's Sunday to Sunday because then you'd have an entire week to go shop. So thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for more videos. Bye.